Hey guys, John Rettinger with John4Lakers.com here, and I'm going to show you the first boot up of my review unit SGH i907, also known as the Samsung Epix. First thing I got to do is remove the SIM card from my iPhone, so I'll use Apple's SIM removal tool, which is really just a paper clip. Push it in, ejects the SIM tray, pull it out, take out my SIM, put that aside. I'll move the camera down here so you guys can see the Samsung. So here it is, we'll go to the back, push the button, release the lever. SIM card goes right in there, so we'll take the card, pop it in, and take this monster of a battery, battery which is an 1800 milliamp hour battery, put it in, put the back on, Slide it in. Let me peel off this plastic on the screen here. You can get to it. There we go. A little bit tricky. There we are. And let's turn this thing on by the power button right on the side. And let's see what they ask us to do. Red light just turned on. Samsung. Hopefully you can see that there. Again, this is running on AT&T's network. It's 3G HSDPA UMTS. <laughs> that logo really just proved it. It's got Wi-Fi, GPS, 2 megapixel camera. This was sent to me just by AT&T to review, so I'm going to do that. I'll use it for a day or so and give you guys my opinions after the weekend. Windows Mobile 6.1 is running. Tap the screen to set up your mobile device. So I'm going to go ahead and need the stylus here. I haven't used one of these in a while. Go ahead and pull that out. I'll tap the screen. All right, tap the screen firmly and accurately. So we'll tap right in the middle. More time. All right. Next, single tap an item to select it, and hold. We can go ahead and skip this. Not necessary. Skip this again. And as I'm touching this, you guys can't see it, but it's vibrating. So I'm getting a little bit of haptic feedback. So complete. All right. So that's pretty much it. Here I am now in Windows Mobile 6.1. And you notice that little arrow right there. Hold it up so you guys can see it. There's a little arrow that looks like a cursor. And that actually works by this little touchpad here. I haven't had a chance to play with this yet. But I will use it and let you guys know what I think. So, this is John Rettinger with John4Lakers.com. I hope you guys enjoyed the first boot up video, and I promise there will be a review coming soon. Hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to check out the website, and I will talk to you guys soon. Link will be up in the sidebar. Bye.